The FBI wants you to take a good look at this new photo of a wanted bank robber, and his name is Milo Mason. He's one of the 10 most wanted fugitives in the country. Investigators say he was part of this robbery in Lakewood last November. You can see everyone wearing masks from the movie Scream. Well, two of the three so-called Scream robbers have been arrested, but Mason is still on the loose tonight. Denver 7 reporter Jennifer Kovaleski spoke to the FBI investigators today, and Jen, they want to find this guy fast, and they are offering a big reward to catch him. Eric, up to $100,000. The FBI says finding Mason is their top priority. He's on the 10 most wanted list, and agents are working seven days a week to hunt him down. We're very concerned. The concerns are the degree of violence, that was demonstrated during the bank robbery. FBI Assistant Special Agent in Charge Bob Evans is talking about wanted bank robber Milo Mason. These are newly released photos of Mason the fugitive agents around the country are now looking for. For the violent crime program, it's our number one priority. The FBI says Mason is one of the three men seen in this chilling surveillance video robbing a Lakewood First Bank. Very intimidating. Those green screen masks. After robbing the bank, the suspects went on a violent crime spree. Police say they shot one man for his van and then shot another woman and beat up her mom while trying to steal their car. Because it was just reckless violence and senseless, the FBI decided that he should be put on the 10 most wanted list. The FBI also believes he's responsible for this robbery at another Lakewood bank in September. Police have caught two of the so called scream robbers, but more than two months later, Mason is still on the run. When somebody uh, again is facing life in prison, um, they take extraordinary steps to avoid us. We feel that he has uh, criminal associates that are helping him. Um, we know he has money from prior bank robbery, and when you're on the run, having cash is, is crucial. Which is why they're asking for the public's help in offering a $100,000 reward for information leading to an arrest. If Milo Mason is watching this, what do you want him to do? I want him to know he should turn himself in, that if he's using friends, family, associates to hide him, to harbor him, he's putting them in danger. And I want him to know that we will continue working tirelessly to put him behind bars. Mason is considered armed and dangerous. He also has ties in Oklahoma, Florida, Nevada, and California. Anyone with information is asked to contact the FBI tip line. Agents say tips from the public could be key to finding Mason. Reporting live in the newsroom, Jennifer Kowaleski, Denver 7.